Hey, what's up to all my beautiful people out there? It's your girl, Keisha T. Who's that? And today, I am hooking up breakfast. Stay tuned for a fun-filled, munchable, crunchable, burnable, smackable, hood-style breakfast coming at you, baby. Oh, <laughs> you saw that. First of all, for the first ultimate, ultimate hood breakfast, baby, you know I gotta get that bacon sizzle. Make it sizz, 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 sizzle like a lizard, like a lizard. Now, first thing we need to do is make it crunchable. Then we flip it over. Over and over, we keep flipping it over until we get both sides nice and burnable. Now, see, from the hood, you ain't from the hood unless you want your bacon burned. And that's how I did. Ghetto hood style breakfast for the crisp. And so I like it burnt, but I don't like it unbearably burnt. It, you know what I'm saying? I want it burnt to a no one lover where it's crispy and crunchy, but also still very munchy and munchy. You know what I'm saying? So what I do is break it off the ones that's burnt it over to the sauce so they can get a little less exposure. And the ones that ain't quite so toasty enough, I put them all up in the center so they can go ahead and roast and toast. Look at that bacon. Look at that beautiful bacon burnt me to perfection. First thing in this freaking morning. That's how I do y'all color you so much. And that's what I do. Don't question my love. Don't question my loyalty. So both of them go hand in hand with one hand. You the hat. Baby, oh my God, it's some banging. Y'all know how I do a breakfast. I don't play. I don't play. Breakfast, 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 breakfast. Stop acting done. You know you want to bite me for that sizzling, beautiful perfection. Oh, stay off a pig eye, yo. You done. But yeah, it's good to start breakfast on that ass, baby. I wouldn't have it no other way, baby. Wait, I love you. You not acting dog. You know better, so do better, baby. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. Don't play with me. Uh, 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 oh, 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 oh. See, the bacon is crisp to perfection and ready to be lifted it off and panned it and put it in a plate. First thing I like to do is make it shake, 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 make it shake like a hollow shake, shake all that all off in it. You know, the preservatives before I plate it all up, baby. You know what I'm saying? Before I actually put that beautiful, 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 excuse me, y'all. Why am I zoomed it up like that? Before I actually put that beautiful bacon onto the plate, we got to let it sizzle, baby. Let it burn like earth. I ain't trying to hurt you. I'll be back for round two when I put them pancakes on that griddle. I'm going to stir them, pop them, pop them, pop them, pop them, pop them, pop them. Put them on the grill for you, baby. Diet it all. So next up on the list, baby, we got that Hungry Jack. Hungry Jack complete buttermilk pancakes. And we're going to see if it do what it do, what it do. Make it do what it's supposed to do. So here's the actual packet here. And I'm about to put this in the water. As you can see, they collide and mix very well. But on the other hand, you do have to do the mixing, if you know what I mean. So you ski, 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 ski. Squirt a little bit up in there. And then when you got it to your desired consistency, or preferable consistency, should I say, you take a whisk or a fork, or any damn thing you can find around the house, and lightly beat until this mixture becomes somewhat of a semi-thick porridge. And once you get to that, that all uh, part of the deal, then you know that it is time to put them meshes in the pan. We will be getting some butter out for this uh, step here, next step, because I like for my pan to be oil. But I cooked the bacon first, and so there will be bacon flavor running through the pancakes. You won't taste it that prevalently, but it does make your pancakes not stick to the pan, and it does make your hot cakes taste a whole lot better and be a whole lot hotter, if you know what I mean. Oh, yeah, baby. I don't play with you. Mm -mm. Tricks is for kids, and I am too grown, bitch. <laughs> but like, a, so any kind of bowl you can find around the house, I had a old little mixing bowl. I put a little bit of water in there, and then I put a little bit of uh, pancake mix, a little bit of water, pancake mix, water, water, pancake mix, pancake mix, water, 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 pancake mix. And for you know what, baby, we just, you know, we on the popper. And it's gonna get to your desired consistency. 
So you shake, 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 round roll, and then you get get out of control and and what up? Anyway, we making pancakes so y'all get your mind right. <laughs> it's too elegant at the same light, but we woke up late, so okay. We can call this brunch instead of breakfast, I guess. I don't know. It's after 10 o'clock because we didn't wake up for like nearly 9.30, 9.45. So, you know, I had to get the kids popping it up and up and up and up and up. So, while they are getting dressed, I am mixing up the ultimate, ultimate Hungry Jack Complete Pancake Ensemble, as you can see right now. I am stirring the hell out of the bowl. Until it gets to my desired consistency. Now, those of you like who don't like the hand stir, you can pull out your professional mixer and have this done in approximately five seconds instead of 20 minutes. You know, <laughs> but I'm at it. I like it old school. I like to go ahead and just, you know, skeet, 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 and, 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 and stir and drop it like it's hot and pick it back up and get burned. You know what I'm saying? Bring it out. You got it. But this is going to be so spectacular. I can't wait. I love me some buttery pancakes that got a little all in them when you bite into them. Oh, ain't nothing like crunchy. Country to make your pancakes munchy. Now be right back, y'all. When I come back, they're going to be on the pan sizzling and making them pancakes going to be ready to be flipped. I'll be right back. But as you can see, I tried to make four and put them on the pan. It's such a consistency, but... They did their own thing as they always do. But like I said, baby, when they get ready to be flipped, they're going to be so good. Pancakes on that hood style level. Ununiform. Let's let them do what they do, what they do, what they do. One batch of the pancakes already plated up. They look so golden, crisp, and bright. Yeah. And delicious. Then we got another load coming up. Bubbling ever so beautifully. Perfectly round. And getting ready to be flipped it and dipped it in some motherfucking syrup. <laughs> You are know the deal. Look at that beautiful bean footage. I'll be back with a little bit of more for today. On this hookup. Breakfast hookup. Yeah, you. Now it's the time for the moment of the day. Where we put them eggs on that daggone grill. Ooh. Make sure you don't put the shell in there like I just did. It's <laughs> a tragic epic fail. But I will remove the shell as you can see ever so carefully. From away from the other portion of the egg. I don't want to take the egg, I just want to take the shell off. Hey, there we go. Egg is, shell is gone. Now the egg is just ever so lovely frying in the pan. And if you crack it good enough, all of the egg will go ahead and go out with very little shell. <laughs> but hey, what's breakfast? And you can't add a little crunch to it. So, yeah, just be careful when you eat them. That's all I can say. Eggs, Benedict. Hey, eggs on a half shell, and I mean that it might be half the shell still left in there, but you will enjoy <laughs> as I stir ever so gently, ever so 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 gently. I must remember those of us less fortunate who can't enjoy this wonderful breakfast that I am preparing this morning. So toss my fork in a scaff for y'all. But right now, I'm about to add a little bit of that oil. That they are all seasoned salt on there. Garlic salt with a little splash of uh, parsley stuck all up in it. And that makes a wonderful season for all your poultry, cooking and breakfast and brunch needs. Check it out. Garlic salt by Lowry's. They do it right first time. Now, like I said, I'm going to proceed to fry and get scrambled the hell out of this egg at the same time. You ain't never seen no beautiful finish like this here. What I do is I beat the hell like that. Uh, motherfucking egg. I beat the egg. And then the egg fight back. And when I feel like a little bit of resistance and the egg is fighting back, I fold her over. I fold her over like an army lock. But I don't, I don't stop there. I don't stop there. I keep folding and molding and, 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 and banging until, but you know it, instead of having a fry egg, you got them scrambled. Hey, lightly scrambled, lightly burned. But it's going in the same place. You know what I'm saying? It's going all in the same place. Look at them eggs. 
Kom igjen! Ja! Ja! Bei det, bei det, Ida! Da er det da. 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 Look at that bacon. Oh my God, look at them eggs. Oh my God, look at them panty cakes. Baby, you know how I do. You know exactly how I do. And breakfast is done dead. I hooked it up. Breakfast hookup. That is that breakfast hookup for you guys today. I hope you enjoyed. Duh!